<laughs> okay. Um, we should go back to the end. <laughs> Just in case. I mean, fucking hell, how much life we got? Three? Yeah. I can imagine, uh, not leveling up properly would really result in a painful death considering how low my HP is. So you came back to date with me. You must be really serious about this. I'll have to take you someplace really special. A place I'd like to spend a lot of time with. Uh, wait, not now. I, I need to sleep first. I need to heal. Uh, where are you? Where's this? We're, we're going around in a U-turn. My ass! See ya. <laughs> oh, I'll wait our date later. Right now, I just need to sleep it in to properly uh, heal myself accordingly. I should probably uh, buy some more uh, of those uh, bicycles, buy icicles as well, just in case. Um, all right, I forgot there's that thing. Why do I keep forgetting? Whatever. Uh, yeah, snowed in, <laughs> snowed in. Nice fun there. I'm pretty sure Toby McGuire or fuck, not Toby, Toby Fox. Really loves his, uh, uh, thing. <laughs> really? <laughs> oh my god, all of them are snoring at the same time. Who the fuck are you, Dory? <laughs> A snore song? Okay. Hiya! You look like you had a great sleep! Which is incredible, because you were the only up there for about two minutes. Here's your money back. You can pay me if you want You're going to stay all night. Uh, hey, at least I healed. I got my money back. Awesome. This is the like the best in ever. All right, let's buy our bicycle again. Although, it's probably best if I buy the cinnamon bun, actually. All right. Hopefully, that's good enough. Oh, fuck, I'm poor. I should probably sell them things, some things or get more gold later on. Uh, the sight of such a friendly town fills you with determination. Save. Alright. Let's, I guess, progress. Fuck, what did Papa say again? Where'd it go? I forgot, completely forgot. I just know I had to rem I remember I had to go through a castle and meet this friendly uh, tubby guy or whatever. Where's that fucking uh, portal to the other side? I think I might have accidentally passed. Oh, whatever. We're here. Uh, I guess I'd like to take the wrong way. It's unlocked. Okay. <laughs> that music. Welcome to Scenic, my house. Enjoy and take your time. Okay. Uh, ooh, a TV. Ooh, it's my favorite game show. It says, stay tuned for a new program, MTT. What? It's usually better than this. This is just a bad episode. Don't judge me. Is it gonna be the same thing? Okay, okay, oops, fuck, I, I gotta stop pressing the A button a lot. Alright, what about this thing? That is my brother's pet rock! He's always forgets to feed it! As usual, I have to take responsibility! The rock is covered in sprinkles. Uh, what about this thing? It's a dirty sock with a series of notes on it. Sans, please pick up your socks! Okay. Don't put it back down, move it! Okay. You moved it two inches! Move it in your room! Okay. And don't bring it back! Okay. It's still here! Didn't you just say not to bring it back to my room? Forget it! <laughs> okay, how about this? Oh, that's a kitchen. What are you- Sir, what are you doing? <laughs> Impressed? I increased the size of the sink! Now I can fit more bones under it! Take a look-see! <laughs> They're a pet dog or something? What happened with him? What? Catch that meddling canine! Curses! <laughs> Sons! Stop plaguing with my life with incidental music! <laughs> oh, this is fun. I love this game so much. Interested in my food museum? Please, pursue my culinary art show. Half of the fridge is filled with containers all labeled spaghetti. The other half contains nothing but an empty bag of chips. That's the trash can! Feel free to visit it any time! My brother always- Whoa, did I just roll my R's for a second? How the hell did I do that? Oh, uh, anyways. My brother... Always goes out to eat, but... Recently, he tries baking something! It was like... A quiche! But filled with sugary 
non-egg substance. How absurd! Okay. Uh, how about this couch? You touch the couch, it makes a jangling sound. You find a bunch of loose coins inside the couch. You got 20G. I hope you don't mind. It's a joke book. Take a look inside. Sure, why not? Inside the joke book was a quantum physics book. You look inside. Inside the quantum physics book is another joke book. You look inside. There's another quantum physics book. You decide to stop. Okay. Uh, is this your room, I'm guessing? That's my room. Are you finished looking around? We could go in. Do whatever people do when they date. Brown chicka wah wah. Nah, no, I'm good. <laughs> I'm gonna visit the sands before we do things. A classic image. It always reminds me of what's important in life. Boning. Alright. The door's locked. Aw. God damn it, Sans. Alright, fine. We'll go to your room. That's my room. Okay. Let's go inside. This is another door within a door. Alright. Uh. Okay, so this is your bed. It's pretty cramped here. That's my bed. If I ever get to the surface, I'd like to drive down a long highway. Wind up my hair. Sun on my skin. Of course, that's just a dream. So instead, I cruise while I snooze. Uh, is this like your collection of chip Pokemon? Ah, yes. Action figures. A great reference for theatrical battle scenarios. How do I have so many? Well, let's just say they're from... A chubby, smiling man who loves to surprise people. Yeah, that's right. Santa! <laughs> okay. Okay, I'll take your word for it. Isn't that flag neato? Undyne found it at the bay. I think it's from the human world. Now, I know what you're thinking. Why would a human flag have a cool skeleton on it? Well, I have a theory. I think humans must have descended from skeletons. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, that book's one of my favorites. Advanced Puzzle Construction for Critical Minds. That next book's another one of my favorites. Peekaboo with Fluffy Bunny. <laughs> the ending always gets me. <laughs> uh, what is this pile of rough? Hey! Those are all the attacks I used on you! Great memories, huh? Seems like it was only yesterday. Even though it basically just happened. Okay... The internet! I'm quite popular there! Wow, did he just implement that, like, dur like as soon as it released? Or was that, like, patched in or something? Because Toby knows his shit. That he is quite definitely popular, without a doubt. Like, I've seen his, like, shit everywhere on, like, YouTube comments, on, like, Twitter posts. I'm just a dozen away from a double-digit follower count. Of course, fame has a steep price. A jealous troll has designed my online persona, always sending me bad puns on a goofy font. <laughs> okay, the computer's internet browser is open to social media site. Alright, what about this door? There are no skeletons inside my closet, except me sometimes. Uh, sure, if he doesn't mind. Clothes are hung up neatly inside. Alright, so, uh, date. So, um, if you've seen everything, do you want to start the date? Sure, why not? Okay, dating start! Why, we're about what? Dating start, what? Here we are, on our date! Fuck! I've actually never done this before. But don't worry, you can spell prepared without several letters from my name. Wait, hold on. Oh, interesting. I snagged an official dating rule book from the library. We're ready to have a great time. Let's see. Step one, press C. Okay, so that's the Y button. On your keyboard for a dating HUD. Sunday, crime, reel it in, population A. Wow, I feel so informed. I think we're ready for step two. Step 2. Ask them on a date. Ahem. <laughs> Human! I, the Great Papyrus, will go on a date with you. <laughs> Fortunately, it only says to ask. <laughs> I guess it means it's time for part 3. 
Step 3. Put on nice clothes, show you care. Wait a second. Wear clothing? That bandana around your head. Oh, fuck, he knows. You're wearing clothing right now! Not only that, earlier today you were also wearing clothing! No, could it be? You've wanted to date me from the very beginning! Yeah, sure, let's make him happy. No! You planned it all! You're way better at dating than I am! No! You're Dating power! <laughs> Don't think you've bested me yet! I, the Great Babarus, have never been beaten at dating, and I never will! I can easily give up with you! You see, I, too, can wear clothing. In fact, I've always wear a special clothes underneath my regular clothes. Oh god, no. Oh god, no, is he naked? Just in case somebody happens to ask me on a date. Me hold! <laughs> oh, okay. Yeah. What do you think of my secret style? No! Your honesty! It shows how much you really care! <laughs> Looks like I'm the man in this relationship, right? However, you don't truly really understand the hidden power of this outfit. Therefore, what you just said is invalid! This date won't escalate any further, unless you find my secret. But that won't happen. Okay. There's no secret to my legs. Just hard work and persuasiveness. This shirt didn't originally say cool, but I improved it! Expert tip, all clothing articles can be improved this way. My hat! My hat! My hat! Yeah! Well, well, you found my secret! I suppose I have no choice! It's a present! A present just for you! You can't even bring yourself to our my delicate wrapping! No! That technique! It's too strong! Counterattack! I'll open the present myself! Do you know what it is? <laughs> That's right! You have no idea! Though this appears to be spaghetti. This ain't any plain old pasta! It's an artisan's work! Silk and spaghetti finely aged in an oaken cask! Then cooked by me, Master Chef Papyrus! Human! It's time to end this! There's no way you can go any further! You mean... You're letting me have it instead? <laughs> because you know how much I love pasta? That is true. Impossible! Taking my present and turning it around on me! Arrgh! Arrgh! No! I kinda like how it's also going over the fucking bar as well. Human! It's clear now. You're madly in love with me! Everything you do, everything you say, it's all been for my sake. Human, I want you to be happy, too. S-Rank! It's time for me to express my feelings. It's time that I told you. I, Pappers, I, um, boy, is it on here, or is it just me? Oh, shoot. Human, I... Uh, I'm sorry. I don't like you the way you like me. R romantically, I mean. I mean, I tried very hard to... I thought that because you flirted with me, that I was supposed to go on a date with you. Then, on the date, feelings would blossom forth. I would be able to match your passion for me. But alas, I, the Great Papyrus, have failed. I feel just the same as before, and instead by dating you, I've only drawn you deeper into your intense love for me. A dark prison of passion with no escape! How could I have done this to my dear friend? Also, it's almost 15 minutes. We'll be right back before he finishes his speech. Be right back, guys! <laughs> 